Ring lighting is often used for image inspection. This video explains how to use ring lighting and the points to consider when selecting one. As the name suggests, ring lighting is ring-shaped lighting. There are many variations in size and shape, and they can be broadly divided into three types, direct rings, low angle rings, and horizontal rings. Additionally, there are lights that combine multiple types of functions. This is an orthodox ring lighting that is suitable for many applications. The installation position is slightly away from the object and close to the camera. Since the light from the LED element is irradiated directly onto the object, the center of the field of view can be efficiently brightened. Let's take an image of the engraving on the lens cap. If you take an image using bar lighting, there will be a shadow and the engraving will not be clearly visible. If you image the same engraving using direct ring lighting, you can capture the background brightly and make the text stand out with high contrast. Good compatibility with objects with low reflectivity. Compared to direct ring lighting, it irradiates light more strongly in the horizontal direction. Install it close to the object. Irradiating light from all around at a low angle can make the unevenness of an object stand out. Let's take an image of a scratch on a transparent smartwatch cover. When imaging with the direct ring lighting introduced earlier, the image is taken from a high angle, so the lighting is reflected and it is difficult to visualize the scratches. If you take an image using low angle ring lighting, you can remove glare from the lighting and make scratches more visible. Our original design combines the functions of a direct ring, low angle ring, and even a diffuse low angle ring into a single housing, further enhancing the utility of existing multi-ring lighting. A ring lighting with a size optimized design and it has a diffuser. This is a highly versatile lighting that does not cause any reflections even when placed close to or away from the object. Let's take an image of the previous objects using hyper multi-ring lighting. First, here is the engraving on the lens cap that was imaged using direct ring illumination earlier. The background is bright and the text stands out with high contrast. Next is the scratch on the transparent smart watch cover that I took earlier using low angle ring lighting. You can make scratches more visible by eliminating glare from lighting. In addition to these functions, it also functions as a diffuse low angle ring lighting. Let's take an image of a scratch on the taper of a detergent bottle. When imaging with low angle ring lighting, the lighting elements will be reflected in the image due to the high reflectance of the object's surface and the angle of the taper. When imaging with hyper multi ring lighting, the lighting elements are not visible in the image, making it possible to visualize scratches. A single light that can be used for both high and low angles. Hyper multi-ring lighting. The last one is horizontal ring lighting. A ring-shaped thin light that irradiates light that faces each other horizontally from all directions. Install it as close to the object as possible. It can capture the edge of an object and minute irregularities and foreign objects on a flat surface that cannot be captured with a low angle ring. Let's take an image of the recycling mark on the plastic partition board. When imaging with low angle ring lighting, the contrast between the mark and the background is low. Imaging with horizontal ring lighting allows for higher contrast and makes marks more visible. We have explained how to choose a ring light, but there are also many other points to consider when it comes to capturing images. Lighting color, size, dimming, lighting distance, angle, camera and lens selection. VS Technology supports your image creation 